Hey YouTube friends, this is Major from Major Honey. I'm here at my cousin Cotton's uh, bee farm here. We're going to try to pull some honey. We got Kim helping us here. Hey Kim. Howdy. So we're, uh, we're going to get started on here and we pulled out the first frame here. We went through these a couple weeks ago and the honey was close to being fully capped. So we're going to, and we had to add boxes and so forth. So we're going to go through here and see what's ready to pull. And this frame here is really close. You got 50% of it. And what you'll have to do is do the shake test. <clears throat> if this is not covered here, then what you can do is you just take it on the side and you shake it a little bit. If you don't see any, if it's not cured enough, it'll, it'll fall out. The nectar will fall out. So on the other side, I'm going to try it as well. Yeah, see? It's good to go then because they've cured it enough to where the honey's in the cells, but they just hadn't capped it all over yet. So that's okay to take that one. So we're going to brush them off the best we can. They're not going to like it. I'll try to brush them all off that I can. But when you go in there to, you see there, I got it. We're gonna put it in our box. And we're gonna put a lid on it real quick. Put it over and get it on there, right? And there we go. So then we'll just move on to the next frame. This one's the same situation. Looks like most of, because uh, it's been a couple weeks since we looked at them and all these was really close then, so. All these frames should be ready to take off. This would be the only time that I really smoke them as heavy is to run them off the run them off the honey so we can won't be as many bees as we have to brush off. Yeah, looks good there. You got a good shot of that. That is pretty.
I was going to be tickled about this. See, now this one's borderline right here. This side looks okay, but they got a lot more open on this side, so we'll do the shake here. Right. And see, you'll, you'll see it. It will fall out like water because the nectar's not been cured. So that's another good one. Getting deeper into the box, you can see that they've got all this backfilled with honey. But what this, this is where the brood was at and hatched. There's maybe one or two cap cells left in there. And so probably by next week or so, next time they come in, that'll be ready to pull too. So we're gonna we're gonna leave this one in there. But what we're gonna do, we're gonna put it in our top box so we're gonna move it up so it'll be on top and then we'll when we come to pull the honey it'll be on top and we won't have to go so deep looking for it Still some brood there. And a little bit on this side as well. The same with the other frame in here. It's capped on that side. But it's still got a little brood on this side, so we're gonna give that a little time. And this one on the outside. It's capped on both sides. What a beautiful frame there.
reason there's some meaning in here is we put this frame in here a while ago. It's a plastic frame and it's not really attached on the bottom. So there's a, bu a bunch of bees up underneath it. So we'll try to smoke them out of there. Glad you stopped by to watch our videos. Like, subscribe. Thank you, and we'll see you next time.